we're subtracting a negative 6 minus a 4. Again, it is a lot easier to change these subtraction problems to addition problems because it's a lot easier to add than it is to subtract. And when I throw in those negatives, it gets a little confusing. So anytime you see a subtraction problem, change it to an addition sign and make that second term a negative. So really this problem is negative 6 plus a negative 4. Again, adding is so much easier than subtraction. So if I have negative 6, plus a negative 4, they're both negative, so we know it has to be negative, and we're just adding the numbers together. 6 plus 4 gets me 10. So a negative 6 minus a 4 is the same thing as negative 6 plus a negative 4, and we get negative 10. Always change those subtraction signs to addition and make that second number a negative, therefore we can just add straight across.